Vice President Yemir Shibajo has called on stakeholders in the environment sector to collaborate to help government meet its emission reduction target. The Vice President made the call at the pre-COP27 National Stakeholders Consultative Forum and Climate Youth Negotiators Capacity Building Workshop. Let's now join our environment correspondent, Jocelyn Alakeche Ada, for details. Vice President Yemi Osibanjo, represented by Mr. Ayo Adeshina, reiterated government's commitment in reducing its emission and meeting its target. He called on the participants of the forum to brainstorm and come up with resolutions that will channel and progress Nigeria's intention at the next climate change meetings. Um, back in 2015, when His Excellency the President signed off to emissions reductions at the COP21 climate change uh, meetings in Paris, it was clear that Nigeria was fully committed to uh, emissions reductions. And he restated this at the COP26 meetings in Glasgow just last year. It is clear that the federal government is committed to emissions reductions and this is something that the entire country uh, and all of us must work together. On his part, the Minister of Environment, Barrister Mohammed Hassan Abdullahi, represented by the Director, Pollution Control and Environmental Health, Dr. Charles Ikea, said the workshop seeks to emphasize key priorities in the negotiation agenda items for the development of a national position and as well as conduct capacity building sessions for negotiators. Issues of finance for climate action are the main subject on the agenda. In the face of recent happenings, we must show our progress and the need for support to build adaptation and resilience and address losses and damages brought about by climate change and for disaster response and recovery. We must also make progress on the social dimensions of climate change and ensure that national commitments include a just transition for people whose jobs and livelihoods are affected as we move towards green economy. And of recent issues such as um, a loss of loss and damage uh, on the front burner. Um, the African group are also uh, discussing this in earnest. Uh, and for us, uh, the group that is working on stock take, where energy transition is um, a key component, are uh, also trying to reach out to, to Nigeria uh, to see how Nigeria can provide that uh, leadership. If you all recall, Nigeria made a very huge commitment to the net zero by 2060. As huge as that is, it's important that we work together, collaborate, purpose, and partnership, providing a roadmap towards the build up of the COP27 to ensure that the commitment for which we made at the COP27 is not just only relevant, but we work together towards ensuring meeting these targets. The Minister of Environment, Barista Mohammed Hassan Abdullahi, said at the COP27 conference, Nigeria will seek for finance on issues of climate change. He said Nigeria will also exhibit its progress made so far. Joycelyn Elakeche Ada, ASO Television News.